Hi guys, so we're going to quickly go over the answers for yesterday's math page. Remember, we had to count the groups and see how many were in each group. And then we colored based on that. So the first one I have here is I have one, two, three, four hearts. So I found the number four and it was red. So I colored my hearts in red. The next one I had were these shoes. So I had one, two. I found the number two. And it said blue, so I colored them in blue. Then here I have stars. I have one, two, three, four, five stars. So I went and found the number five, so that's my number five. It said yellow, so I colored them in yellow. Then I come here to my little bears. I had one, two, three. So I find the number three, and it is brown. So I color them in brown. Next I have my elephant. I only have one elephant. So I find the number one. It said black, so I colored it in black. Then here I have little, I have gloves. So I had one, two gloves. Number two says blue, so I colored them in blue. Now for this one, Miss Martini did not color in because I made a mistake yesterday in our video. My video, I told you that it was a group, so you would count them as one, two, three. Then I changed it and I said because they're different, they're considered one. So if you colored it in black because it was the number one, that's okay. But when Miss Martini went back and I looked at it and I thought about it, this is supposed to be a group together. So how many do I have in my group? I have one, two, three. So I find the number three and it is brown. So if you colored this in brown or you colored this in black, it's okay. So either one works for this because I made the mistake and I did not make it clear. So I'm sorry about that. But this can either be three, a group of three and colored in brown. Or if you said the fork is something different, the knife is something different, and the spoon is something different. You said that they're one. That's okay too. So I hope you guys got them all.